I guess I could do a quick uh, quick walk around here. I haven't shown the car in a while. Of course it rains after I got it washed, right? All right, tubes. I am finally making an update here. Wow, I've never used it like this. The camera has been messing up on me, and so it isn't, uh, I, I've, I've made this video like three times and it keeps messing up. So that's on me. And here is the, what is it? 5,500 mile update. So I'm almost at my first, uh, my first oil change. And my last video, I talked about wanting to pay off this car on the first quarter. That was my first quarter goals. And lo and behold, we actually did it. So, uh, it's uh, it's really nice to to be able to say that I set a goal and I did it, and it you know it actually happened. But it, it wasn't all for, it wasn't like there was a sacrifice. Uh, you know, a lot of the of the funds that were coming in, I I literally moved into paying this car. So I'm glad it's over. Like now I can focus more on my business because business have been going well, and I like to hire, and that requires money as well. So. We are going to move in that direction. And like I said, I'm super excited about uh, being done with this part. Uh, I wanna get ceramic tinting on the windows because it is Texas and it does get hot. And so that is definitely one thing I'm going to do. Um, I actually work with uh, a detailing company like that's attached to my office. And so they're gonna do it for me. They don't actually necessarily uh, do that, but you know, that's something they like to add. So I have no problem giving uh the business there and letting them try it out you know if it goes bad then the at worst i just uh I just remove it and so what updates do i have as far as the car goes i still love the car i guess i can put it like this i still love the car um it's wonderful like the other day i turned it on and it caused some alarms to go off and i was like what the hell uh when i got my i got my wash my car washed at that at my office and i heard them move the car around i was like is that my car it's so freaking loud initially once it cool uh you know once the first five or ten minutes pass it it uh it calms down but it's really uh it's kind of aggressive at first but yeah i'm gonna do the window tinting then i want to do uh i want to do like i want to do stuff to the car but not until like 20 or 30 or 40 thousand miles i don't know exactly when like i'm not tired of the car as it is and I don't want to change it yet. Like I'll change it. For example, let's say I get to 60,000 miles and I'm like, I'm sick of this car. Instead of buying a new car, maybe I'll wrap it, you know? Or maybe I'll buy a new car and then start doing this one. I don't know. The future, we don't know what's gonna happen. So hopefully things continue to be good. And uh, what, what, so on another note, one thing that used to annoy me about this car is that at night, whenever you would drive, this screen is so big. It's wonderful, by the way. I drove a, I drove a Jeep uh, in uh, Vancouver, and it had a very HD infotainment system, but it was so small that it was kind of dangerous to be driving on the highway and like looking at it because you have to like really focus on on the screen because it's so small. But this one, what's annoying about it is that it's huge, and at night this thing is like a you know like a giant TV blasting in your face. So what I did, uh, what I found out is if you go to settings you can turn off the display and then you just have to hold this volume button in order to make it come back again. So problem solved. Uh, I guess I'll give some numbers just to, just to like wrap this whole part up about the car as in how I paid for it and stuff. Um, just cause I think it's interesting. So I did three years and a $6,000 payment. So a uh, down payment. So that's, uh, and that was in December of 17th. Then each payment was supposed to be $879 or $869. And I just paid $10,000 a month for three months. So I technically paid the car off in like three months and like a week. So again, that's super cool. I had some money saved up for the car. So it wasn't like, uh, it wasn't like, I, I had this planned already. Cause I wanted, I never wanted to get back in debt. So I wasn't, I'm kind of scarred because I had student loan debt, I had credit card debt and uh, that really sucked for a long time. And it, looking back at it, like it wasn't that much. It was maybe like 15 to, 15 to $20,000 total, which is a lot, like it is a lot. That's a lot, that's a lot. Uh, and it took me forever to pay it off. 
Uh, but you know, then I compared it to this, it was a $30,000 loan and it's like paid off, like it's nuts. So, um, so I paid that and it was cool going to the, to the bank cause you can't pay more than $10,000 from online. So like I had to make it in two payments, which is really weird. You have to pay the $869 first, then you have to pay the difference. So five, 5,000 minus the 869 cause you can only do $5,000 payments. And then you have to pay $5,000. So you, you kind of have to make two or three different payments each month so that it hits the 10,000. But the last month, the third month, when I requested to pay the, the whole thing off, it was like $10,100 or something like that. And I, I submitted the payment, but the, it like, once I submitted the payment to, for $10,100, it, it crashed. Like the website just logged me out. And I was like, did I pay it or did I not pay it? So I called the bank. The guy said that if it's over $10,000, you have to go to the bank in order to pay it. And I was like, well, I actually don't, I just got the loan with you guys. I have a different bank. Can I, you know, do I take my debit card from another bank and pay at uh, your bank? And they're like, yeah, that's, that's how it works. So I went up there and uh, it was funny because I was like, hi, I'd like to pay my car off. And the guy's like, oh, okay, what's your account? You know, and I told him and then He's like, okay, so you'd like to make a payment? And I was like, yeah, I'd like to pay the whole thing off. He's like, the $879? I was, not, I was like, no, like the whole thing. He's like, I'll be right back. <laughs> and he went to go talk to his manager. So I don't know, I, I don't know if like, I think he was new because he was like, how do I do that? But again, I was just like, then sure enough, I put my debit card and submitted the transaction and I got declined and I got it obviously because I got a text from my bank saying, are you really trying to pay this much at this bank for this thing? And I was like, yes. And then I was able to pay it and they gave me a receipt you know like here you go and I was like that's so crazy like I'm not used to big numbers like that but I guess for other people especially like that's just normal like that happens so it's kind of like an insight into the scales of life right like it's it's almost like what perspective are you in or looking at it I don't know a little bit more uh, philosophical there but anyways I did and I got the I got a mail and I got the mail saying like this is your car you own it now and I got the title and I'm like wow this is nuts because I've never had a car <laughs> uh, I always had hand-me-downs my parents you know my, my parents gave me their cars or my parents bought me the car like a Honda Accord like 2002 um, so yeah it's really cool so that's it, that's the update. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Somebody had a question about mileage. To sum that up, it's really not that great, but I think it's worth it if you enjoy driving a car like this. Uh, I don't think it's that bad though. Like I never feel like, oh God, I have to pump gas again. With my commute, which is about 40 miles round trip to the office and back to my apartment, it's about 40 miles, so that's 200 miles. And then on the weekends, you know, might go to a parent's house, might go places, we always use my car. So probably I would say like 250 miles on average. I would guess, I don't actually know. Uh, see I can look here but when I when I pump gas it's like you have 400 miles of range or whatever I'm like mm, do I so and it's not true it's just because it's not moving uh, so yeah that that is my uh, my video let me know if you have any questions I really appreciate the comments and the follows peace